Hello guys, what's up? This is Jeremy from Extreme Boomers here with another video. This is an HQ six, seven, eight, nine, and maybe ten base design for rifleman, hookah, everything. Yeah. So before we get going, I just want to say get higher defenses than me. I have the crappiest level defenses. Yeah. Level 1 mortars, level 1 cannon, level 1, level 3 machine guns, level just low level. And once you get that, my base should be pretty good. I say pretty good, I mean pretty good. And so the sniper towers are key to uh, low defenses. Uh, sword cannons, once you get uh, two of them, those are key. And that's at HQ8, uh, so once you get. Uh, once you get to HQ8, just just balance, balance it, um, the, move the sniper tower, all that. And so for the first line of defense, the riflemen get shot down a little bit by uh, those uh, machine guns. And while they're getting, while they're taking out the machine guns, the sniper towers in the background are uh, taking them out one by one. And usually when it's 20, 30 riflemen, sniper towers are one to two shotting them which could take them out pretty fast. So the second key is the line of defense, which is the sculptor, the residence, the storages, the vault, the radar, just anything to get in the way so that the sniper tower will pick them off. And if they flare, if they flare past them, the mines will get them and the sniper towers will, will still get them and the mortars will just destroy them. And it's a slow, painful death, so I would not attack with the riflemen. It'll be easier with hookah, where you start off with the machine guns and uh, the zookas are way slower than the uh, thing. Let me just get a view. If you guys want to just copy it right now, just be, feel free because I there's no copyright on it. Uh, so. With the hookah, you start off with the heavies move faster than the zookas, so it'll take a while because they have low damage to take out the machine guns and then the sniper towers in the background will start to uh, lower their health little by little. And once uh, the zookas start going, they just they just rip apart the distraction. But once the distraction gets ripped out, they kind of it, it sh they should spread out, I guess, the zookas, so it'll be less and less, and then the cannon right there should start taking them out. And um, as soon as all the heavies are down, the mortars will be in range, and it's just dead. So uh, now I'm gonna go to a replay that I got of a guy using like strategy that um, I don't know. It's like heavy right or no no heavies. It's riflemen, zookas, and warriors. I couldn't think of words. So I'm just gonna speed it up quick till uh till they uh get going, I guess. He flares to the HQ right away and the mines just oh <laughs> if the mines if it weren't for the mines he probably would have taken them out. And right now it's about at a little over half health and he's flying straight for the HQ again and let's just speed it up. Look at how close they got. That's like twenty percent. Anyway, um if you guys like this video just please leave a thumbs up and uh i'll come back with a uh, update if people start attacking me on this base uh anyway guys i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this base design uh leave some support if you want a playlist down in the description for other hq base designs christian had one for a higher level about uh 26 yeah uh feel free to check that one out and uh leave some love peace out guys